Can you talk a little bit about the importance of this win this game, and especially having a bounce back after a tough game against GW? Well, the last game we played, it was a tough loss. We kind of just fell apart. Um, we lost focus throughout the course of the game. We had a few days to go home so we gathered ourselves and we come back to practice. And we came back to practice, everybody just came to that same come and go. And um, the thing is, we just don't want to string losses together, um, especially consecutively, you know. So we just came out here and just played hard and played tough. And everybody just wanted to win. We just came together and it came down to the crucial possessions and everything. So, how tough was it to have that attitude coming off the GW game? Was it hard to marshal up that? It is. It puts a bad taste in your mouth. But um, I feel like everybody on our team is professionals about their job, and we understand how important it is. And we just love to play, and we love to compete. And any chance we get, especially against a team like Temple, we like to just take it out. And um, I felt that we did a good job doing that today. Talk about the defensive effort in the second half. I mean, they we were making some shots. Had some open threes in the first half. It seemed like the guys kind of put that away and really forced them to take some uncomfortable shots. We just talked about the defense. Um, at halftime, we just we went in there with the mindset that we didn't want the same thing to happen again that happened against George Washington. And um, for most of us, we were a part of the team when we played Temple a few years ago when we lost that Temple. And uh, it was a blowout. Turn the favor. And um, it's a great opportunity to be able to do that here in the room. Our fans changed so much everything. So we came out. We didn't want to let the same thing happen that just happened in this past Wednesday. We did a good job of doing that. Is there anything specifically defensive that was working? Or? Um, we haven't played zone that much this year. And um, we tried to lock down on zone. And I feel like our zone did a, did a pretty decent job at defending their scores. They have uh, a lot of a lot of their wing players, they have people players averaging like 20 points, 15 and 12. And we were just trying to focus our defense towards them. And we know if we go man to man, that just cause a lot of help defense, a lot of defensive breakdowns. And then that would cause our, our big players, our post players to have to step up and help the guards out. And then that would just, you know, that's kind of what they want. Basically, that's how everybody else has been playing. So we didn't want to feed into that. We wanted to play uh, this game on our time. I think we did a good job with that as well. Did you have a good view of Jordan's three-pointer? Yes. Yeah. And it was right on the whole way. What, what was your feeling right there? Um, one thing when you're playing a guard position, if anybody switches and gives you space for a shot, I feel like you have to take that shot just to keep him honest. If you don't take that shot, then you're not going to guard you throughout the course of the game, and you're going to take it as a threat. And I feel like Jordan does a good job of keeping defenders on their heels. If he has any type of space, he's going to take the shot, or he's going to take you all the way to the basket, regardless of the size. And he has confidence. He took the shot and knocked it down like we expected. Best basketball is a long season. There's nights you play great, there's nights you don't. You might have had two of those back to back here. Mm -hmm. um, coaches are always talking about measuring step games. Up. Was this one of those? Was this a, a statement game for you guys as a team? I feel like um, every game is a statement game because it just shows you know, the course of the season and how many steps we take to reach our ultimate goal, which is to be in the best team that we can be in our conference and going you know, to the NCAA tournament. And key wins like this will help us build that. It helps our confidence, and um, it, it just it just does a lot for the team. And um, it's just, I, I understand, it's, it is like a showing our progression over the course of the season, especially after a tough loss at home. And it just shows, you know, probably this time last year, we would have suffered a tough loss like this. We probably would have been down about this game. We probably would have been, would have been able to tell how we compete today. But this year, the George Washington game is in the past. And we played this game like this was the first game of the season. And we went out here and went home. You guys know who Temple is. Mm -hmm. I mean, you've, you've been watching basketball since you were. They're always in the, in the tournament. Mm -hmm. They're one of the two best teams out of the great basketball city. One of the best coaches in the country. I mean, it, in this, this is special, isn't it? it I mean, is. I don't want you to say it because I want you to, but I mean, it is. 
It is. It's, I mean, that's one of the great things about playing college basketball. You get the opportunity to show that you can do things against opponents with the name of Temple. Um, and I feel like we just we did a great job in preparation. I mean, we prepared for Temple like we prepared for Howard. We prepared for Howard like they were North Carolina or Duke. We prepared for every opponent the same, like they're the best opponent that we're ever going to play against. And we just try to take it to them and we just try to stick together. Regardless of what happens, we know we have our ups and downs. But if we stick together and we just play tough, we can deal with it.